My name is Linda Anno Flati and I studied aromatherapy qualifying in 2003. I am a volunteer at Red Cross, however I do work as part of the pain management team. This team is headed up by an anaesthetist, Dr. Anissa Bate. Um, we also have a specialist pain sister, uh, Sister Carolis, and we have a physiotherapist and then the aromatherapy team. I think Linda Ann is a, a victim of her own success in that she's definitely the most popular person on the wards and even in the ICU. The main objective with the work at Red Cross is to provide comfort and relief of pain to the children. When a child comes into the hospital, they're normally really anxious, stressed and traumatized. And the aromatherapy massage helps to relieve this emotional pain. And the emotional pain often exacerbates physical pain. So if we can relieve them of the stress and anxiety, the physical pain is often relieved as well. My son is currently in the hospital. He had a kidney transplant, um, so the aromatherapy helped him with a lot of pain management, makes him sleep better and very calm. This is my daughter Razia. Aromatherapy massages has helped her quite a lot. She's had a lot of body pains which has helped her a lot once she's received the aromatherapy massages. She's much more calm and relaxed. With aromatherapy oil it's helped a lot with me, especially with my daughter's skin condition. Um, I've seen a lot of really good effects come out of children who've had aromatherapy and I'm delighted that we can actually offer this as part of our multidisciplinary teamwork. The international award from the Gut for Safe Foundation was the highlight of my professional career. Um, this has opened many doors for me and being chosen from the stalwarts of the aromatherapy community to receive this award is an unbelievable honor. So she plays multiple roles in our hospital. Often she works behind the scenes. She's not someone that seeks attention but she is certainly someone we are very grateful to have.